Betty. Welcome to another episode of Watch Once Over. Today we're going to be looking at this beautiful Chinese watch called Atelier Win. This is the Perception, and it is a really, really nice watch. This watch is done up in all 904L steel. And first, right off the bat, it gives me some Gerald Genta vibes. The bracelet reminds me of a, a Vacheron. At first, when I first saw it, I thought it was a Vacheron Constantine. And for what you get for about $3,000, this watch really punches above its weight. It has 100 meters of hermeticity. You have a screw down crown. And you also have this beautiful case back that depicts a stone or an iron dragon. I really like that. Now the rotor is tungsten. And then the movement on here is a 41 hour autonomy Chinese movement that houses a high beat original caliber called the SL1588. Uh, this is supplied by uh, Dang Dong and it has 41 hours of autonomy. The uh, movement is accurate. It's pretty accurate uh, for what you get. It's plus or minus 10 seconds a day. Okay. It's also been regulated in five positions. That doesn't mean it's going to be super accurate, but at least it's going to be consistent. So it's going to be regulated in um, five positions. And that was also sent in to China's top national research lab, which is the or logical research institute light, uh, of light industry so i think it's a pretty well-rounded watch the case is amazing done up in this 904l steel you have a inverted uh polished bezel sapphire crystal with anti-reflective coating beautiful leaf style hands and a beautifully done up copper guilloshi dial it is made of copper, the dial. That's hard to do. And I, when I, from what I understand, this is China, China, China's only um, guilloche, hand guilloche uh, person that, that can do this, it's as, far as, as far as I know. Now, the bracelet is affixed with screws. You have a twin trigger deployant, plus you have a toolless adjustment. You just push this logo in. And you can see it moves when donning or removing the watch. You have this extra slider. See that slider? So when you put the watch on, it goes on really easy and closes with a snick. Looks really good. Everything is high quality. And to be honest with you, if this was a Swiss watch, it would probably be three or four times the price. I mean, that's that's just a fact. You get this beautiful uh, guilloche dial. Now, moving in on the dial a little bit, which is the star of the show. Like I said, it is a copper-based dial. You have that um, Chinese-type decoration all around the outside of the edge of the dial, which is loomed. And then you have these beautiful loomed uh, kind of leaf-style hands on here. And then just a straight sewing needle type second hand. It's put together real, really well. Um, I wish the logo was loomed, but the Atelier Win um, dial is is it's honestly really good. You know, I I'm, I don't have any complaints about this watch. Um, I think it is a little expensive uh, for the three thousand dollars because you do have of movement that um, is hand winding but does not hack uh, you do have two positions that is one position for winding and screwing the crown down and you pull it out to set the time so that's a good thing no ghost position and then you do get to see a little bit of that um that movement just a little bit of it and that is a little slither of sapphire that's protecting that the back is bolt down, and that dragon looks really good. It's moving on that a little bit. The dragon looks really, really good. 
and then you get a quick release uh, toolless uh, bracelet release. And I do believe you can get uh, straps for this also. I did see it on, on the website with rubber straps. So that's another thing that's pretty cool. Now, let's get to what everybody wants to see, and at, that is the loom. I do not know the grade or the substance of this loom, but it is pretty good. I'll light it up with my black light, and I'll take you out with this beautiful loom from Atelier Wynn. Let me know what you guys think about this watch. Um, this Chinese uh, need to quit copying watches and just make their own watches. Seems like they can do a pretty daggone good job. Let me know what you guys think about this. Um, that's your loom shot. As you can see, it's pretty cool. Never seen this one before. I like it. Let me know what you guys think. That's the watch once over for today. My name is Big E. God bless. And as usual, I'll catch you on the next video.